Good Saturday afternoon. I'm meteorologist Tony Sadiku in my home living room weather center. Hope you're having a fantastic day as we all try to stay at home for the most part. But if you are heading outside, maybe for a walk or jog, weather looks fantastic. Certainly plenty toasty. That's been the story all day long. High of 87 in Charlotte is remarkable. Just three degrees shy of what would have been a record, 90 degrees. Keep my average is only 67 this time of the year. Still got bright looking skies. Uh, we do have some high clouds mixing in, but really no issues if you're heading out this evening. Those temperatures will find their way down, but it'll still be pretty comfortable if you're heading out down into the 70s by late tonight. Sun sets at 742. While we're nice and quiet today, it's a much different story to our west. We've got a system developing that we'll need to keep a close eye on tomorrow, but it looks like at least right now, most of the energy with it will miss us to the north, but that's not going to mean we're not going to get any impacts from this. Future cast through tonight shows no real issues. Then by tomorrow afternoon, we'll watch maybe an isolated shower across the mountains. Notice this really falls apart as it works its way into the Charlotte area, only going with about a 20% chance for rain. Although I can't rule out a rumble of thunder tomorrow afternoon, but nothing to keep us from warming up big time. Highs tomorrow. Mid 80s again, some areas to the south could be knocking on 90 degrees, but that's about it in terms of the incredible spring like warmth. We'll start to ease those temperatures down by Monday, upper 70s, but still looking nice. Then we've got another system on Tuesday that looks to give us a better chance for rain. But look at those temperatures back into the 60s and slowly warming things up by the end of the week. That's your forecast. Have a great day.